What's up, you guys? So y'all tell me, normally I, I report the news to y'all, but I want y'all to tell me what is going on with our girl Taraji. My sister sent me this post of Taraji the other day and people are still talking about it, about her new look. It's much sexier than she normally dresses. You can see here Taraji Henson on the red carpet for, I believe the movie is called Million Dollar Heist. She's on the red carpet and she has a totally new look. Her hair is like that Rihanna type hairstyle how Rihanna used to have that short red hair but it's not her hair that people are talking about people are talking about this look like with everything out and I might have to censor this actually because YouTube YouTube um, is funny about stuff like that so I might have to censor this but Taraji has the cleavage out the abs out the legs out she has everything out and people are like what is going on Taraji and y'all know fashion wise that it looks better when you pick just one thing to show off whether it's your legs cleavage your abs your back whatever it is it kind of just looks better if you just pick one like focal point but for this you can see where taraji has her legs out cleavage out abs out everything is out out and so a lot of people are going in in the comments like you can see this fan saying nah you can put this look to rest i love you but this was a bit much and another fan saying, we have to be honest, this is not flattering. Y'all tell me, if you think it's flattering, put a one. If not, put a two. Someone else said, I really don't like this look on her and I'm not hating. I just see Taraji as super classy. She can be sexy, but normally does it with class. Yeah, there's, there's definitely a way to do it. Someone else said, no girl, come better than this. Hope you're okay. Now, things like this, I'm sure Taraji is fine, but things like this, looks like this, do make people wonder, like, are you okay, girl? Why do you have everything hanging out? And if you keep up with my videos, you know that I did post about a week ago about Taraji selling her to condos. Now, at this point, we don't know if she's being forced to sell them or if she just wants to sell them and move. But she does have something going on because she was complaining about not getting paid her worth. And then we saw her turn around and sell her condos. And now she's on the red carpet looking like this. So it does look like she has something going on. But at this point, we just don't know. We can't confirm. But it does have people talking. Now, in my opinion, I don't know if she's having like a midlife crisis or something like this, but I do know like actresses, a lot of times when they want to be casted differently, they'll do makeovers like this. So when I first saw these sets of photographs, I assumed that Taraji, maybe she's felt like she wasn't getting the role she wanted. Maybe she's not getting the love interest roles anymore. Maybe she's getting a different type of role. And so I felt like she was stepping out trying to show people like I can still be the love interest. Like I can still play those roles that I've been playing. That's how I saw it. But y'all leave a comment. Let me know what you think about Taraji's new look. So some of y'all, if y'all watched my video yesterday, y'all already know that according to Megan Good's friends, Megan Good allegedly is paying everything, everything in her relationship with Jonathan Majors down to his child support. Now that's all allegedly and it's all from sources close to Megan. That was reported yesterday and now it's being reported that Jonathan Majors is signing autographs for $140 a pop. The Hollywood Reporter reports the public hasn't seen much of 34-year-old actor Jonathan Majors lately. He was sentenced in April to a 52-week domestic violence intervention program after being convicted of reckless assault in the third degree and harassment in December after an altercation with his ex-girlfriend. So ever since that happened, he lost a lot of movie roles. They say Jonathan Majors' Sundance 2023 film Magazine Dreams was initially considered an awards contender, but it was dropped by Searchlight Pictures. And then his supervillain character Kang the Conqueror from the Marvel Cinematic Universe, which was supposed to be a huge role for him, he also got dropped from that. But they say on Sunday, September 15th, two days after his first treatment compliance date, because he has to go to these DV classes, Two days after his first date, he'll be at the Valley Forge Casino Resort in King of Prussia, Pennsylvania, selling autographs for $140 and pro shop photographs for $160. And so signing autographs, selling signed autographs is kind of like a step back in Jonathan Major's career as far as where he was headed. He was headed up. His, his career was on an upward trajectory. And now you can see ever since he did what he did to his ex-girlfriend, you can see where everything is on the decline to the point where it looks like he's now forced to sell autographs for $140 each. Oh, hey, guys. 
guys. This is Jonathan Majors. Come meet me for the first time ever at Famous Monsters Festival in Pennsylvania, September 14th and 15th. See you soon. See you there. So y'all leave a comment and let me know what you think about Jonathan Major's career trajectory going backwards at this point. Leave a comment and let me know do you think he'll ever be able to revive his career. As always, thanks for watching. Layla, 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 tell us it all.